What's going on, you guys? So I wanted to talk about this fallen archbishop boss fight because a couple friends of mine, as well as a couple viewers, have had some trouble with this boss, especially the second phase. So I figure I'll just show my fight, kind of talk over it a little bit. I didn't think to do a proper how-to on this fight because honestly, it didn't really give me that much trouble. And on top of that, I don't really know any tricks to it. I just kind of went in there and fought it like a souls boss. You know, I, I would block and then dodge out of the block. I would try and get close to it, get behind it, burn it. I was just using my uh, fire on the legion arm a lot and just tried to burn it. And I did that for the first phase, which you can see. Uh, and then I had my NPC with me, all right? So if you're uh, into using the NPCs, that's what I did. And that helped a lot. It just got the attention on them. You know, as with any other boss, they help with getting the attention away from me. So I just kind of went in there and found some openings and put in some damage. And of course, the first phase is, is pretty easy. I'm sure a lot of you guys probably think that. It's the second phase that's kind of weird. But for whatever reason, I just didn't stress over it too much. But you know what? Now that I kind of think about it, and this goes across every Souls game. When it comes to big beast bosses like this, I typically do better than a human boss, for example. Like if it's a human boss, I struggle more. When it's a big beast, I beast it a lot. Like I, I feel more confident. I feel like, I don't know why, I guess because they're just such a big target and I just know I have to wrap around and get behind them and just do what I can to stay close. Um, so that's kind of what I did going into this. I, I locked on. As you can see, we're in the second phase. I'm watching it with you guys. And this centipede looking thing that comes out the front, that's the difficult part, right? Because uh, it does swing at you. Uh, the whole body of this monster will swing at you too with the tongue and everything. And my NPC is still alive. <laughs> so that helped. Uh, clearly, it must have helped because again, it gets the attention away from me. So I'm able to kind of get in there and put in some work. And basically, this is a boss that has two ends to it. You got the, the monster face on one end, you got the centipede on the other. So I'm watching it right now and I'm kind of staying in front of the monster face and just kind of putting in some damage, dodging those, those attacks, which were pretty easy for me. Um, and I'm really not trying to gloat at all. The rest of the, the game kicks my ass, okay? So think of it like that. All the bosses, they gave me trouble. But this one probably just gave me the least trouble, you know? So I just went in there, I burned him. The NPC at this point is dead. Oh, no, 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 still alive. The NPC though, the MVP right here. I thought I thought they were dead. No, they're still going. <laughs> so yeah, I'm, I'm just, you know what? Maybe I got lucky, maybe because the NPC survived, was able to kind of help me out, put in a little bit of damage. I just went in there and, and just hit the damn thing. I mean, look at this. You know, you just kind of be aggressive, get in there, hit the body. I would say just hope your NPC survives. If not, I would probably try and stay in front of the monster face, try and hit that part, and then focus on the rest when you only absolutely have to. And that's it. See, I was just kind of in there, just tanking a, a little bit and dodging when I had to, and um, it worked out. And I think at this point, I didn't really farm that much or anything yet, not till the next big boss which I've already uploaded videos on. Um, but yeah, man, I, I, I mean, he dead. <laughs> Anyways, no, I really hope this video could help a little bit. I didn't want to do like a proper how-to and edit everything down and do slow motion parts because honestly, I mean, what am I going to say? Like, oh, I dodged here. I, you know, I, I burned him here. You know, I feel like just showing you the fight would, would help maybe enough. Uh, hopefully it does. All right. Let me know in the comment section if it did. And um, don't think I'm, I mean, I'm being lazy right now. I'm really not. I just have so much content that I want to do. It's like this wasn't even planned, you know, but I, I hope it helps those who were kind of hitting me up about this fight. I've had people actually ask me tips for this fight. So that's why I'm making this video. I hope you enjoyed. Thank you so much for watching and I will catch you guys later. All right. Bye.